Hey, is everybody? It's Timber Clutch here, and we have another unboxing. Oh yeah, buddy! What we have today? Let's figure it out. Actually, I know what it is, but. Let's see what we got in here. And of course. Oh man. There is some language here. Busting that out here. Look at that. All right, check that out. It is made in China. All right. Well, let's open this up then. There's a clue. There's a clue. Oh, it's in pieces. Oh my goodness, that means some assembly is required. Well, what we have here is a flywheel. A very, very nice one too. It's good, good heavyweight, good metal. Uh, wow, that's pretty exciting actually. So, can you see, have you figured it out yet? What this wonderful thing is. Oh, yeah, 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 there we go. Let's try to open this up carefully. Because there is a very... Alrighty. Let's see what the instructions say. I, I already know for a fact I'm going to have to get a pencil and uh, let's see if we can get that to click in. There we go. And we'll bring this up. Oh my goodness. That is. This is a Stirling engine, and it works based on heat. Oh my God, that's cold. Well, supposedly, it should work on the heat of my hand, but I can tell already that it's going to take forever to get heat from my hand to get this to work. So anyway. Let us pause this and get a cup of hot water and we will see how fun this thing is. Okay, let's see here. We will pause. 
is or better yet um, no come on one camera come on you can do it focus there you go so anyway the principles of this thing I'll go ahead and explain it and then I'll try to do something about hot water here in a second um, what you have is a displacer piston so there's air inside of this cylinder and this cylinder is the power cylinder okay, yeah. so what happens is, is these two plates there's a temperature differential so this plate is hot this plate is cold so the air flowing between this displacer piston will heat up and expand causing this to move up and then as it cools it will contract pulling it down and uh, I think that's how that principle works as you can see it so this is going to be exciting let me get a cup of coffee let me get a cup of hot coffee Honestly, this this is supposedly will work. Will supposedly work based on any temperature difference. It's almost warm enough to actually start working. Is it actually going to start running? Maybe. It definitely needs lubricated. Um, I do know that I've kind of glanced at the instructions and it recommends using a, a pencil lead for lubrication. And uh, I can honestly say with the amount of squeakage that yes that probably needs to happen before I run it too terribly much. So basically this thing is running off of the heat from the hot water on the lower plate and the top plate is cooler than that that temperature difference and that's what's causing it to move is the the hot air and the cold air you know, cold air contracts, hot air expands, and so because of that, it's moving that piston in and out. The small one. And yeah, I 
think it's sitting there running just fine. All on hot air. <laughs> so this, uh, this is my Sterling engine and many thanks to uh, my significant other for purchasing this for my birthday. Uh, I love it to death. This thing is awesome. And uh, if y'all would like to see any other videos with this, leave a comment, like it, subscribe, and uh, y'all know the routine. Y'all stay toasty.